Hi, I'm Joe Laszlo, and I'm here at the 2016 IAB Mobile Marketplace, where we just wrapped up our town hall sessions. IAB town halls bring industry leaders together to discuss major issues, challenges, problems, and opportunities, and to help set the IAB's agenda on these topics, um, guiding the industry towards further growth. Let's hear what they had to say on leveraging location data in mobile advertising. My name is Vikas Gupta. I'm the Director of Marketing of Factual. Hi, I'm Jessica Booth, Director of Product Marketing for Celtra. Hi, I'm Ivo. I'm Senior Product Manager at the Trade Desk. So we just wrapped up a town hall on the uses of location data in mobile advertising. And we're going to summarize some of the key takeaways from that town hall um, and some of the, the main points that we learned. Uh, Jessica? Yeah, so when it comes to crafting your creative message, you want to know when it's applicable to be generic and when it's more important to be very specific to reach a, a consumer in a specific moment where they're maybe buying or maybe interested in really open to connecting with a brand in that moment that they're at right then. Yeah, location-based advertising, um, when done right, could be very effective. Um, you know, one of the biggest uses that we have, uh, we integrate with Factual, and um, we can, you know, layer different types of radius or different size radius to serve the appropriate creative for that particular radius. So you can have, you know, you can target very vi vi valuable users that are close to your, uh, you know, brick-and-mortar store, mm -hmm. um, and you can target specific users uh, they're within driving distance with a particular creative and in a very dynamic and effective way. Yeah, so uh, to summarize, I think one of the interesting things in this conversation was that we spent a lot of time talking about um, how to use the data to make more interesting creative as opposed to spending a lot of time talking about the data itself, which was probably the main <coughs> topic of conversation one, two, three years back. And so I feel like the industry has definitely moved forward. That being said, though, there still seems to be one challenge that repeatedly came up in the room. So, Evo? Yeah, so uh, the challenge of scale that definitely comes up. And I think uh, it's important to understand that, you know, targeting that particular user in a, you know, 50 meter radius of a store, uh, and then the user happens to actually open the phone and then get an ad served, um, that's definitely not the best way to approach when you're looking at scale. Uh, you certainly can um, uh, apply many different strategies, uh, and then one of the primary ones is, um, you know, looking back into folks that have been in this store, so you can actually expand that scale into people that have historically visited that store, for example. Uh, there's many creative ways to uh, to increase scale. You can certainly uh, uh, target it. Right now, SSPs provide a lot of interesting data. It's not just lot launch, so you can actually open up and target more users at, at a um, a, a lot scale of a radius, but then combine that with other signals um, and their data on top of that, you can certainly reach your audience. Yeah, and I think when it comes to creative storytelling, um, making sure that you find people in the moments where they're most likely to convert and catering the message to that, like making sure that your message is relevant for who you're reaching, when you're reaching, and where you happen to be touching base with them. So. Great. Well, thank you both. Sure. Thank you. Thank you.